On top, six to five, as you see Johnson chiseling his way, feeding to Duncan, who maneuvers on Collins. Body, they say, is failing him. We talk to players around the league, they say his body is quitting on him. NBA on the championship team. It's Duncan with a pick on Ostertag, and Ostertag bit it easy. It'd be another option. It's Tim Duncan. Count it! Never. Tonight may change that trend. We begin the fourth quarter. Duncan and Ostertag catching outside the lane. Duncan, the fake. He's got 40. Tim Duncan has scored 40. Inside Duncan working on Carl Malone. One on one. No defensive help here. Last time it was a jump ball. Tim Duncan has just tied his career high. Hornacek. Oh, Duncan fell. Malone falls. The ball is out of bounds. It goes back to the Spurs. And a foul. And Duncan has it again. Why not keep going to him, huh? Well, I mean, you've got to be crazy if you don't. It's been a long time since I've seen a center. Of their last three wins. Very impressive beating the Trailblazers at then. Only Kareem should remain ahead of him in the scoring department. And that's uh, pretty impressive. Here's Duncan working against Ostertag and scores. Robinson, you take care of your man. Here's Duncan working around Ostertag and right there. A couple of grizzled veterans right there. Kerr looking for a shot. Great pass to Duncan going down in the middle. And the Spurs are up again. And when he doesn't dwell on the shot, he seems to be more comfortable. Here is Duncan with a couple of fakes. Duncan banks it in. Versus a power move and taking it strong to make Duncan go for the block and a potential foul. Duncan, oh, the smooth jumper over Fuller. So Duncan now can block 10 shots. That's why they're up by 6 with 6.38 to go in the fourth. The basket by Duncan Good and the foul. And by that I mean total shooting. Twos, threes, and foul line. Duncan with the turnaround, and Duncan now with 34, and the wow. Spurs did it uh, confidence-wise for San Antonio, what this game means. Oh, yeah, well, you know, their coach, he believes that they're playing the best basketball. Then he goes low post as he does now. Many times then he'll come out high, initiate the offense, and then they go side to side. This time to Duncan, who looks at Ewing and crazy because Oakley out there. Johnson double team. Oakley, good defense, and Duncan still puts it in the other night. No scholarships, of course, in the Patriot League. Duncan. You were trying to poke it away. Boy, Tim Duncan. Such poise. Duncan again. Ewing gets a little tighter on him because Duncan Choney can hit the shot. Nice spin. Off balance. What a shot from Duncan. Spurs assists in the entire series. Duncan with the hook, and that's the way game four starts. Sean Elliott around a Duncan screen, returns it to him for the jumper. Just quietly, they're carving them up right now. They were just resetting the shot clock on that last whistle. Look at that move by Duncan. You know, he's got such great... Inside three minutes to play in a long first quarter. There have been 17 fouls called already, and now Dick Pavetta makes it 18 to Duncan. Fox on him. Looks to spin baseline and just muscles that shot up. Danny Antonio with the first possession. Here is Duncan, and he puts the Spurs up. Entry pass to Tim Duncan, who has scored all four points that he has in the first quarter tonight. Working his way in, and now, and now five on the shot clock. Daniels can't go anywhere, and Duncan with one second puts it up and scores off the glass. Zerbiak has 16 and three are tied with 11 for the uh, Timberwolves. Oh, moving in. Oh, oh. Not to be denied. San Antonio, it's obvious that Dallas is coming out. They're hopping well early with the second shot. Oh, was hitting that little 15-footer. Let's see if he continues to do that in this game. Duncan goes right by Booth and throws it down. What? Spurs have hit their last four shots, two of them from Avery Johnson. Duncan makes it their last five. Now Howard has Duncan out on the floor with eight on the shot clock. Look at that with the ball face. And one. It's now one of 15, by the way. 18 points Spurs lead. Duncan has his back in Chip Ring to the finals twice with Portland in the early 90s, but no title. Duncan. He's got eight. 
one seed, but they have the best record of any eight seed in the history of the NBA. They won 47 games. Duncan hits it, plus he'll come to the line. Very impressive for a guy who plays much of the time out on the perimeter. He is a great stick, and they give him chances. A steal, which he shouldn't. Garnett didn't get it, and they the entire game because they're a jump shooting team. Duncan from Malik Rose, who's in for the first time. Garnett rejects it, but Duncan stays with it. And Duncan. Robinson screens for him. Mustarovich has Duncan now on the switch. He pops it over him and hits. Just one after one. But they've opened it up here in this second quarter. Over Garnett. Duncan scores again. Duncan into a crowd. Five seconds to shoot. Duncan turns to face the hoop. Two seconds. Let's it go. And that may have sealed it. Siamo una tripla doppia, ne ha messe 5 in questa stagione, partenza clamorosa! Siete in una gara tra le più belle che potremmo proporvi oggi a livello di NBA. Lo scarico di Bowen è per Duncan che cerca ancora, sono neppure pochissimi quelli di Tim Duncan, altrettanto irreali, eccolo tirare dall'altro capolavoro di testa di un giocatore cerebrale come uno scacchista su un campo di basket, è veramente nelle mani di Stephen Jackson, un falco che continua a recuperare palloni, qui alza per Tim Duncan! Non è fatta da fuori classe, però quando c'è Garnett in campo Reggio. Duncan contro Garnett! Guardate la lotta per la posizione. Chiaramente non può sapere a questo punto dove sia il tabellone. Guardate quante volte è stato spinto fuori. Boom, boom! di Jackson come KG abbia toccato questa palla non è dato a saperlo adesso siamo dall'altra parte va verso il centro Duncan niente tabellino stiamo già pertando coi 20 in 21 bianco e avete visto che Duncan può andare verso il fondo da una parte andare verso il centro dall'altra tirare con l'aiuto del tabellone tirare senza l'aiuto del tabellone quello che fa veramente la differenza leggendo questi due giocatori è